Hi and welcome guys. So this is the review of the Jelly Time Jelly Bean R7.1 by Random Lamb for HTC Desire SD and Inspire Fuji. So this ROM is based on Cyanogen Mode 10 and is running on the latest latest version of Android Jelly Bean Android version 4.1.1. So first let me just show you. Android version 4.1.1 Jelly Time R7.1. So in this ROM, all the features of the Jelly Bean R is working perfectly. The camera works perfectly. There is no issue with it. The Wi-Fi, the Bluetooth, multi-touch, mic, USB tethering works perfectly. There is no issue with any of the features. And this ROM is quite smooth. You can just see it. There are no lags in this ROM. Fast and stable. Right from the lock screen, you get the Jelly Bean lock screen, which is very smooth. And the notification bar of this ROM is quite useful because you get four toggles here, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, GPS and and the audio option for your phone. So that's very useful. It saves a lot of time. And you get the EOSP style recent app menu from where you can just slide to close it or just click to open it. And the camera of this ROM is working perfectly. So guys, let me just show you. And now let me just record video at 720p the high definition so here the camera is recording the video so that's worked perfectly so there is no issue with it and guys in this ROM by default you get three launchers the launcher the Nova launcher and the tribute set I prefer the Nova launcher because you get different transactions, effects and you get you can scroll the bar right below and you can have many short, shortcuts here. So that's very useful. So now let's go to the app menu. The G app doesn't come pre-installed in this ROM so you have to install the G apps but many useful files like ES file manager, ROM manager the Nova launcher itself and the, and the Apollo music player com, comes pre-installed and you get all the Jelly Bean widgets in this ROM here you can just see the smoothness of this ROM very fast and you also get the DSP manager here which has got many options for your headphone to improve your sound quality so just have a look and in the settings menu you get the system option here where you have different tweaks for your phone the status bar tweaks you can just change the clock style signal status style and different tweaks for you here so just check it notification drawer tweaks you can just enable or disable the power widget and different and various tweaks for your notification drawer and you can also change the font size I'm currently on the normal you can just decrease it or just increase it here and you got, you get a hardware key option from where you can just change the, what you want after you press any key here below so just have a look and here below you get a performance tab from where you can just decrease or increase the CPU frequency it is very useful to just increase your performance or to save battery and you get the 16 bit transparency here memory, memory management option and surface improvement options and you also get some developer option to customize your phone according to your need so have a look here so guys overall this is one of the best jelly bean rom i've come across as this is very smooth and many features are working perfectly the camera works perfectly so guys if you are looking for a jailbin rom you can just try this rom so that's all about the review part of this rom if you like my video just click the thumbs up button below and subscribe for more videos and if you have any query just comment below or hit me on facebook so thank you for watching this video have a nice day